Hi, I where I work is a store. I do work in retail, so my husband passed away on 1-22-21 from COVID. I have since asked my boss if he would allow me for a transfer to a store here where I live because it's closer. I financially cannot afford to drive up to the store at five days a week. He put me back on the schedule and against my availabilities, one to tens. My availability is 10 to 7. 10 in the morning to 7 at night. So, I called the store yesterday and talked to the assistant manager. It's like, hey, I need transfer paperwork because I financially can't afford to come up here. He's like, well, I'm not going to step on the store director's toes. And I'm like, okay. But I can't come up there and work due to the severity of the case. So he's like, well, we're in dire straits here. We don't have enough employees and we can't financially afford to lose another person. And you know what? That's okay. I feel bad. I love this store. You know, I love all the associates I work with. But they're not accommodating someone whose husband passed away from COVID. And it's not right. It's not fair. But I have to call the HR department, which I've already done, and left a message. Now, remind you, I have been calling HR since my husband went in the hospital on January 3rd, 2021. Still not got a call back. And today is January, February 15th, 2021. Still waiting. I do have doctor's notes that give me time off until the 19th of next month, but I'm trying to make decisions based on what I can do. And they are really not allowing that, and that's not right, and that is not fair. So, you work for a company, especially a corporate company, when they should give you a transfer due to a situation that is so raw and real to me, and they're like, no, we're not going to give you a transfer. This is not right. Thank you for watching my video. Comment, like, and subscribe. And please turn on the notification bell so you know when I upload my next video. Thank you and have a great day. Bye.